Hey everyone, Saint Crypt here, um, and I'm just here today to say thank you. Thank you all so much for the support on The Curse of 2170. I never expected it to do as good as it did to get 190 views in the only the first six days. So thank you guys. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. Like, genuinely, this is, like, one of the most favorite, one of the hardest, definitely, like, one of the biggest projects I've ever done. So, thank you so much for all the support on it. I really, really, really appreciate it. Um, so, yeah. I, I still can't believe that. 190 views in six days. That's insane. So, thank you all so much. I have a few announcements about stuff I want to do, um, because obviously this week I didn't upload a video. I took a break because, you know, after freaking spending a whole Halloween night handing out candy to everyone, trying to get a video uploaded on onto my phone and deleting so many things, getting so aggravated to get it in a good quality. And finally getting it done, you know, I obviously wanted to take a break. But I'm feeling way more energized. I'm feeling way more ready for the next chapter um, of what to do. So I'm going to give you a few announcements. So um, I'm working on music right now as well. Um, today I'm going to try to go out to the store and get a, a uh, some money for, or like, um, uh, get a gift card for the feature on one of my songs I want to do. By the way, they're all comedy rap songs and stuff. I, I don't know. I think you guys will enjoy it. Um, and if you're not into comedy um, rap and just like comedy music in general, that's fine. Because um, deep within the song, deep within my albums, there will be a deeper message. Which will, yeah, you guys I think will write, like... So, I'm focusing on music. Um, another thing I really want to focus on is the next chapter for these movies and everything. So, um, I want to tell you guys about this. So, I have a plan. I thought about this a few days ago, and I talked about it with my friend Michael. You obviously, saw, you obviously heard him in The Curse of 2170, which, by the way, in the sequel, he may return. Um, and speaking about the sequel, this is important because it all correlates to this idea I had. Let me, I, I hate that my bed falls over. But anyways, my idea I have is, I don't know, sort of my own universe, connecting it all together, all of my skits together, all my movies together, and creating the ZCCU, or... Um, I don't know, I'm still workshopping the name, but just the Zanecraft Cinematic Connected, whatever you want to call it, universe. And, um, just connecting it all together, I think would be cool. I just need to do it the right way. So this is very future. This is future, alright? I'm just saying this just in case you're interested in what happens next with all my stories and stuff. But I will say this, it's all connected. And the question is, how would it be all connected? Because you got the curse, or curse two hundred seventy. You got the truth of twenty twenty. You got Kylo Ren's stepdad. Wait, no, those are already connected with the curse two hundred seventy. Yeah, but um, you got all these skits. How am I gonna connect mainly the two together? The truth of twenty twenty and the curse of two hundred seventy. Well, it's simple. I mean, they're already in the same universe already. Um, basically. So, if I'm correct, well, I'm of course correct because I made it, but The Curse of 2170 takes place in January before any COVID stuff happened, before, before like anything really happens, but it's still like the 2019 40, foreshadowing to 2020 still exists, but, um, and the truth of 2020, it's still canon with The Curse of 2170 universe. Which should make sense because nobody knew what was basically going to happen in January 2020. So, yeah. Um, 
the Curse of 2170 sequel, and I'm going to end the video on this. Um, I don't know how it's going to go, but I do have an idea in mind, and I just want to thank my therapist for the idea, because it's actually pretty fun. Um, it's basically just me coming back, um, finding out the truth about everything, you guys finding out about what what the secrets were what was inside the bag what was what was um the story between behind the family and um more info about Fredrickson um you guys will all find it out and in the end it will be a battle a battle of the ages it will be an insane fight in this new location it's it's going to be awesome trust me it's gonna be great so yeah um i think that's all i have to really say just once again thank you guys so much for all the support and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video this has been zing crapped oh that's so cheesy all right i'll see you guys in the next video peace out